Let me introduce you to my favorite taco, black beans, sweet potatoes, and a sassy, spicy, savory coleslaw topping. You'll need some fresh sweet potatoes that you will cut in half and steam until tender. I like using my Instapot year-round. It doesn't heat up the kitchen during the hot summer months. Place a steamer basket inside your Instapot or stovetop pan. Add water and steam until tender. No need to peel your sweet potatoes. I've got a slick trick to show you. Using a pair of tongs, gently lift out the steamed sweet potatoes and you're going to place them cut side down into a bowl. Using your tongs, just grab the top piece of the sweet potato and give it a good shake and they'll slip right out. I like using an old-fashioned potato smasher. I just want to blend it and smooth out the texture so there's no lumps and bumps. No need to add any liquids or seasonings. Grab a can of black beans, rinse them, drain them, and put them into a bowl. Add your rinsed, drained black beans to the sweet potatoes and blend them up. In all honesty, I could eat it just like this, a big bowl of steamed sweet potatoes and black beans. It is yummy. Let's get our taco shells prepared. I like melting some cheese in between two corn tortillas. I use this method for all of my tacos. It helps give them more stamina and you don't have blowouts in the bottom of your shells using this method. Stack them in a bowl and start assembling your tacos. Start by layering each shell with the mixture of the sweet potatoes and black beans. Up next, the coleslaw. And I want to give you a couple of tips on how I sass up my coleslaw. You can use your own recipe for coleslaw or store-bought coleslaw, but here's what I do to sass it up. I add some fresh chopped cilantro Oh, it just gives it that little bit of mm, zing. I use Adobe Milling Chipotle Habanero Hot Sauce, just seasoned to taste. The surprise ingredient is pineapple chunks. This coleslaw tastes so good, dressed up with those extra items. It's sweet, spicy, and savory. Garnish the tacos with a little smoked paprika. Oh, and the flavors marry so well together. And then, enjoy. Let me know if you make these tacos. Oh, so good.